Hey guys, it's JD from Ponzo World, and today we're unboxing and reviewing this pet care kit made by Cranova. Now this is a $36 pet uh, care kit that you can find on Amazon, and uh, once again, basically what this is, is a pet care kit. It comes with a, a trimmer, um, like a brush kind of like thing and stuff like that, basically to uh, help trim your dog and stuff so you don't have to bring it to uh, groomers. You can just do it at home for what seems to be a pretty decently cheap price. Um, even you could get this entire thing for the probably less than what you would get at like a groomer's just one time grooming your dog. For example, like my grandpa, you know, he has a dog and he brings it down to the groomer every week and I believe he spends $40 each time. So once a week, it's $40 when you get this thing for $36 and you could do it at home uh, very easily. So I guess there's not much more to say about this thing. So let's go ahead and show you around the box. So on the front here, you can see the uh, groom or the uh, trimmer here. It also says Cronova right here, which is obviously the brand. Uh, professional pet climmer, or clipper, sorry, uh, designed for your pet grooming needs. On the side here, we have uh, Voltage, uh, LTE, M, no, I don't know what that is, but uh, something. Uh, it also has Voltage, Working Life, Battery Capacity, 2000 milliamps. That seems pretty good. And then the blade material is also ceramic and titanium. Okay, pretty cool. On the side here, uh, labels and stuff like that. We also have a um, code here, label, whatever you want to call it, if you want to take a look at that. There you go. And then on the back here, uh, pretty much the exact same thing as on the front, just a uh, picture of a different dog, which by the way, I will be demonstrating this um, on our dog. So I am gonna actually put it to you. So let's go in and open this thing up. And I don't believe, yeah, I was gonna say it's not a seal. So let's go in and open this up. And okay, so it looks like on top, yeah. So this is kind of like the brush thing I was talking about. So. Uh, basically what this is yeah, pretty nice so far so basically you kind of put this on like a glove and then you simply run this over the top of your dog and this kind of once again acts as a brush and it gets all the hair off so that's actually pretty cool so there's that and then in here we have um, instructions and then some other stuff I'm gonna set that all, all off to the side see once again the instructions right there okay so here is all what it comes with um i'll just go and go over this now so it comes with the climmer or clipper sorry clipper. i don't know where i'm getting that from uh clipper uh the comb and then all the uh comb ends i don't know what to call them but there's that it comes with a bunch of those right here and it also comes with a charging cable cleaning brush uh clipper oil okay uh a file some hair cutting shears uh, thinning scissors, pet nail clipper, and then the grooming glove, and then obviously the user manual. Uh, so there's that. So let's go and take all that out of here. So you can see here, oh, they actually come in little bags. Once again, pretty cool. So these are the scissors for cutting the hair. I'm going to go and put that back in this little bag and set it off to the side here. Then we also have this thing here, which once again, I'm going to have to look at the manual here. That is the thinning scissors. Okay, so not 100% sure what those do, but I'm sure I will find out. So there's that. Then we also have the nail clippers here, which I believe, yeah, okay. So there it is. Pretty cool. Uh, charging cable to charge the uh, trimmer, I would assume. Oh, check that out. That's kind of interesting. I was expecting it to be like micro USB. That's a pretty cool little plug. Uh, so there's that, and then we also have the file here, which, yep, definitely a file, it is rough. And then we also have the uh, comb right here. And, okay, that actually seems to be very good quality. Wow, that's metal. That's crazy. Very strong metal, too. <laughs> wow, uh, that's actually kind of impressive. Okay, so cool, uh, metal comb. Very impressed by that. Then we also have the uh, trimmer here. Gonna take it out here 
And okay, so that's where it plugs in at the bottom using the USB cord over there. It looks like in the power button or in the uh, middle here, you have a power button, uh, speed up maybe, and then speed down. Uh, maybe a screen here. I'm gonna have to look at that. Uh, adjustments here. And then I would assume this is the battery compartment, which really in there. So I'll take that off, off camera. Uh, so there's that. I also have a little brush down here. And then the oil, which I don't know what that's for. But once again, I'm sure I'll find out. Uh, you also have the battery here for the trimmer 2000 milliamp. And then all the attachments for the end. So uh, there it all is. I'm going to assume there's yeah, nothing else. So uh, there it is. So what I'll go in and do now is uh, go outside and I guess go ahead and demonstrate all these products on her dog and go ahead and see how they all perform. So, uh, so far, pretty cool though. All right, so here I have the uh, grooming glove here and here's our dog, Angel, say hi. <laughs> all right, so let's go and see how this works. Ooh, what is that? Don't eat it. <laughs> <laughs> what? Who is getting some already? She's not liking being on the leash right now. It's okay. Uh, she's biting it though. She's not sure what to think of this. Check it out. It is working. And we do uh, groom her pretty, or well, I guess not groom, but comb her often. So we're not going to get that much out, but it is working. So pretty cool. So there's that. Pretty nice. All right, second thing here is the comb. Go ahead and show it. So it's pretty obvious, it's just a comb, very basic. And we got a little something in it. Now keep in mind, we did just go over it with the uh, grooming glove. Yep, you can see we got a little bit of something. Now again, this is no different than one that you would use on like your hair or anything. So pretty basic once again. So there you go. Got some hair in that too, so pretty cool. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and demonstrate the uh, scissors here. Once again, there they are. Man, metal. Uh-oh, just trying to escape. I'm gonna try to show this the best we can. Once again, trying our best here. Yep. Just like that, it's obviously cutting it off. Don't wanna cut too much off here, so. There you go, pretty cool. Oh, there we go. Almost didn't get it there. Did we get it? Uh -huh. All right, cool. Hopefully you heard it just like that. Oh, oh, trying to escape again. It's okay, Angel. But there you go, those did work. Hopefully you heard it right as we turned on the clip. It did cut, so pretty cool. Just gonna try this again. Oh. There we go, cut something off. She doesn't know what to think of this. But there you go, did work, so pretty nice. All right, so there it was. Now keep in mind, I tried my best to demonstrate uh, a few of these products now, a few of them, like for example, um, like the charging cord here. I'm, there's no point in demonstrating that. It's just to charge this thing. It has nothing to do with the dog. Uh, so like, I'm not gonna demonstrate this or anything. It's just a cord, but uh, also a few other things. The file here, I didn't demonstrate that. It's pretty self-explanatory though. And uh, I don't think Angel, also known as our dog, uh, would not really uh, like us doing this. She didn't really like any of this stuff, uh, quite honestly. Now that's just our dog. If your dog is used to getting groomed and stuff, I'm sure they're gonna be fine with all this stuff. Uh, but like, for example, our dog never been groomed. Uh, so I don't think she will really care for this uh, file. So we didn't demonstrate that, but once again, pretty self-explanatory. You get their little uh, claws um, at the end. I guess you call them the fingernails. Uh, you could call them, I don't know. Um, but basically, just like a file on a human, you do it just like that. So there's the file, Dem didn't demonstrate it, but very basic, please pretty self-explanatory uh, scissors I demonstrated and those worked just fine obviously they're just pretty much uh, normal scissors uh, and they did work once again just fine now these are also made out of metal so uh, pretty cool pretty nice so off to the side uh, this was for uh, the oil for trimmer oil I believe it is now that's uh, not that's not required or anything I believe it's just to lubricate uh, so there's that 
Um, and then these are little ends for here. Um, I just kept the stock one on it, so I don't need to demonstrate these either. Uh, it just depends on what you want. Um, also, the comb here, obviously we did demonstrate that. Pretty much, once again, a normal comb, except it's made out of metal. So, once again, pretty cool. And uh, it did work just fine, as you saw in the video. Uh, and these right here. Now, these, I always forget the name. It's gonna, okay, so they're thinning scissors. Now, I can't really demonstrate that on our dog. And my mom explained this to me. She said it's for a, like, if your dog has a thick undercoat, apparently. Um, our dog doesn't, so I couldn't demonstrate these. It's just simply not going to show if I even use these. So there's that. If your dog has a thick undercoat or a thick fur, uh, these will come in handy. So once again, pretty cool. Uh, this little thing right here, this is for clearing out the hair on the uh, trimmer here. You go like that and it brings all the hair out. So there's that. Uh, also the uh, little claw trimmers here. Uh, we didn't demonstrate though, or we did, sorry. Um, hopefully I got the beginning on video. I just barely did, uh, but mom clipped, or, uh, clipped her dew claw um, on the dog and it did come off perfectly fine. So pretty cool. Once again, is working just fine. Um, so once again, pretty much everything so far is a thumbs up. Now also the, uh, um, what's this thing called? Grooming, um, glove, I guess. <laughs> kind of at a loss for words. I'm not quite sure what to call this thing, but, uh, grooming glove, um, does work just fine. There's still actually a little bit of hair on here. Uh, but once again, as you saw in the video, it did get a good amount of hair off. So definitely worked once again, perfectly fine. Then also for the uh, trimmer here, you can see it was working just fine in the video. It did cut a bit of hair off. Um, now this right here, this little dial, I guess you call it, that is to raise and lower this white part here. So you can see, if I have it on, I'm gonna bring it down, and it goes down. So there's that. So I assume if you want to cut more off, you bring it um, down, the white thing down. And if you want to cut a little less off, uh, go ahead and bring it up. So there's that. Uh, this is also speed up and down. You can see this is max speed. And then this is middle, then low speed. So there's that. And then also on this little screen here, I'm gonna turn this thing off. Actually, I better turn it on so then you can see the screen. But on the little screen here, you can see indicates the speed. And then also the battery percentage right there. Now it did come with about, I would say 50% out of the box. So uh, pretty cool. So once again, so far, everything on here definitely gets a thumbs up from me and does seem to be working well now. One thing I do want to see if I can go ahead and easily, uh, let's go and see what it's called. Okay, so these guide combs. I want to see how easy it is to take one of these off. Now, I haven't even tried this, so let's go and see here. Hopefully I don't break it. <laughs> um, okay, so, yeah, okay. I'm gonna have to look at the instructions for this. Actually, I'll just do that on video because I really wanted to see if I could get that off easily. In case you guys are wondering. Oh, okay. Yeah, so that's how it goes. You push up from the uh, back here. Yeah, okay. I'm sure you could get it off. As you can see in the instructions, that is it right there. So I'm sure you could get it off somehow. Just takes a little bit of prying. So there it is. Uh, so once again, so far, everything here definitely gets a thumbs up from me. So guess what I'll go and do now is go ahead and stop this clip and uh, go ahead and give you guys my foul opinions. All right, so overall, what do I think of this pet grooming kit? I think this thing is actually pretty darn good for the price. Now keep in mind, $36 and you're getting all this. Now, as I mentioned previously um, in the first clip when I unbox this thing, um, I mentioned that my grandpa once again has a dog and it spends around like $40 a, or a week to get his dog groomed and that's just for one week and he does that all the time each week. Um, when you could get this thing here, which does the exact same things, just takes a little bit of your time and you could do it for even $5 less than my grandpa does it for a week and you could do this forever. So instead of spending, you know, $40 a week on a dog for grooming, you can just get this entire kit for 35 and you could do it yourself forever. So uh, once again, in my opinion, 
pretty darn good. Everything here seems to be very well made. Very impressed. Once again, this cone's made out of metal. Uh, could have totally been made out of plastic and stuff, but no, they went ahead and went to the extra measure to make it metal. So that's pretty cool. Um, also the uh, scissors and stuff here, once again, made out of metal. So pretty darn nice in my opinion. Um, overall, once again, I think this thing comes with quite a bit for what you're paying and uh, everything seems to be of good working quality. So uh, yeah, if you're looking for a pretty good uh, set of pet grooming uh, products, a kit, whatever you want, uh, that you're on Amazon and you want one, uh, I definitely go ahead and recommend this one made by Cronova. So once again, so far pretty good. So uh, yeah, I guess that's really it for this video. Hope everybody enjoyed and don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see y'all next time. Goodbye.